carry my mate. Get out that cherry wire made spinner. Almost time, almost time. What's up YouTube? Hey guys, we're back out here on our favorite water right here. We got about maybe 30 minutes to an hour to fish. I brought three rods only and baits that I have confidence in, such as the chatter bait, the spinner bait, which I call this the cherry limeade. And I also brought my buzz bait just in case. And uh, we, got, we got some sinkos guys. We're gonna see if we can work our confidence baits. So that way when we get to the river, these are things I'm gonna be tossing on the Arkansas River guys. Might might not be the exact spinner, but I'm definitely gonna be tossing some spinner baits, buzz baits if they're up up top, and I'm definitely gonna be throwing chatter baits. Stay tuned and see if we catch anything. Yeah. There's a bunch of grass out there. There's a bunch of milfoil about a foot and a half under the water. So what I'm doing is I'm bringing, I'm dragging my buzz, well, not my buzz bait, but I'm dragging my spinner through there, and of course I'm popping it. I'm making it look like a bait ball coming through there and I'm trying to trigger some of these bass that are getting ready to spawn because as you can see, a lot of bass we caught out of here look like they had a golf ball in their stomach because they're full of eggs. They're still feeding and they haven't staged yet, but what we're trying to do is we're trying to ca catch them while they're active or hungry and since I know the river rises and falls just like this place does, it's a tide thing, I kind of want to go over here and kind of like adjust towards the different tides and adjust towards the different moves of the fish because there's some areas where the fish have abandoned we went down further earlier and the fish just abandoned that shallow water down there so what we're trying to do is we're trying to find them in little pools like we would if we were fishing the river so uh just in case you guys are wondering that's what we're doing stay tuned Take our spinner bait off. Should have brought my pliers, but I didn't. Don't try this at home, guys. I've been doing this for a while. We're gonna get. Let's see. I'm gonna throw a chatter bait on, but we want a specific chatter bait. There we go. Oh, is that it? Yes. Okay, guys. We got our AOT. Our AOT bluegill chatterbait. We're going to throwing this. For one, it's got a it's a slower moving bait. And slower moving bait. And it also thumps really well out here. So it sends out a lot of vibration, guys chunk that out there and see if we can get them to bite it. They usually love this thing, so that's something that y'all see me throwing on the river a lot too, the AOT chowder bait. If there's no current, I can really run that thing the way I want to. There we go. There we go. Not a lot of tag in. 